Hey Plus Size Nerd, this is Nancy Basile and today I am trying on lots of plus size jeans. I ordered them from Prime Wardrobe, about eight of them, so we're gonna walk through and see how each pair fits, which ones I like, which ones I'm keeping, and which ones I'm sending back. Plus size jeans are really tricky to buy because every woman's shape is different and jeans are really made for men, so they tend to be straight up and down. For the last 10 years or so, I've worn nothing but torrid jeggings because they're stretchy and comfortable and I love them. But today I'm trying on real plus size jeans that have buttons and seams and everything. If you're excited to see these plus size jeans, give me a thumbs up. That way other plus size nerds will see this video too. And links to every single pair of jeans I'm trying on are in the description. <laughs> Wrangler jeans are a super slimming I bought in size 20 short. I'm five foot one and they were still too long on me. So if I bought these, I'd have to hem them. They weren't too tight. They weren't too loose. I did have a lot of gapping at the waist, but not so much that it would stick out from my t-shirt or bother me. So overall, I would give these a four out of five. <laughs> signature mid-rise skinny jeans. Uh, these are also in size 20. I really like these. Uh, they're stretchy, so that's partly why I like them. They fit really well. There wasn't really any gapping at the waist. I was concerned when I first put them on because you kind of have to yank them, especially if you're a little bit sweaty. But I love the dark stain, the dark dye dark blue, whatever, and I like the fit. They're super comfortable and I thought they looked pretty good. I give these five out of five. <laughs> Okay, so these Amanda Swan series, tapered leg, classic rise, 20W short jeans. They're super comfortable. They're slightly too big, just like the teeniest bit too big. But I don't know if you saw my leg in that one part. <laughs> I think I'm too short. Even though these are considered short jeans, if a, if a leg isn't skinny on a short woman, <laughs> It ends up giving you like lumberjack legs, I think. You look more like a weeble than like you have legs. So, ugh, I mean, they are comfortable, but I just don't think they're that attractive. I'm gonna give these a two out of five. <laughs> Thank you. 
America sculpting skinny jeans um, fit really well. This is going to sound strange. So I think they fit really well. I think they know how to contour to a plus size woman's body. But I really felt them when I had them on compared to those Levi's that I raved about. Um, like I said, this fits really well. And if you're really into jeans, I bet you would love them. I'm not really into jeans. I'm more of a leggings person or a sports skirt person. So I just, I don't know, I could really feel them on. I'm gonna give them a 4.5. Um, but again, if you're looking for a dark wash, really good fitting jean, um, these, these were great. I'd love to know which pair you liked best or if you're thinking about buying any of these for yourself now, let me know in the comments. Wallflower Luscious Curvy Fit Boot Cut. There is a lot going on with these jeans. I gotta say, I do not like all the contrast. Look at all that. Look, look at all of that happening. Nobody needs to draw that much attention to my big ass. <laughs> they fit okay. Um, they were too long on me, but that's not a surprise because they're boot cut. The distress, uh, distress to the wash, the contrast in the stitching, all the designs on the back pocket are just like screaming, look at my big ass. <laughs> so, no. so I'm going to use a one out of five. <laughs> Okay, these are Lee Relaxed Fit Straight Leg. Again, 20W. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. Uh, apparently, I need to stick to skinny jeans, which seems counterintuitive. But the straight leg, I think you saw, I feel like a lumberjack because um, there's all that bag between my butt and my thigh. Uh, I don't want to give the illusion that there's more going on to me than there is because, you know, the idea is to look a little slimmer. So uh, these are well made and I like the look of them, but I did not like the fit. So I'm going to give these a two out of five. <laughs> skinny ankle, mid-rise, slim through hip and thigh, um, but not too slim in the waist. So these fit really well, um, and I'll be honest, they have a little bit of distressing in the wash. I like these. Uh, there's the skinny part. 20W is the size I got. I like how they fit, they're comfortable, I like how they look. If I were buying more jeans, I would keep these. But I already fell in love with that other pair of jeans, which I'm keeping. So, sorry guys, they could be the understudy. Uh, I'm gonna give this a 4.5 out of 5.
So this is an Amazon Essentials brand. I got this in a 20 short. I like them. They're very comfortable. They feel, you know what they feel like? They feel like you've had them for years already and that you've washed them and washed them and they're super soft and comfortable. Um, they had just enough stretch in them. They're slightly a lighter shade than the um, Levi's that I liked so much, but I gotta say, I really recommend these. The denim is slightly thinner than the other jeans that I've tried on. And some people might not like that because maybe you like designer type clothing or maybe you get cold. I boil, in fact, I'm sweating a good bit after this try on. So the thinner fabric is kind of a plus for me. So I'm gonna give these a 4.5 out of five. Really, I, I surprisingly like these a lot. Who knew? So the Levi Signature Series jeans are the winner. They're the ones I'm keeping. Thanks for watching. Be sure to hit the thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already so that you can see more try-on videos for plus-size nerds. Thanks for watching.